Hey everyone, I'm Pete Dalladay. Welcome to this edition of Hometown PTBO. It doesn't get more uh, hometown than this uh, young lady right here. This is uh, Irish Millie, born and raised right here in Peterborough. And uh, Millie, how are you doing? Thanks for joining us. Well, thanks for having me, Pete. How are you doing? We're doing good. We're doing good. What, what's new with Irish Millie? I mean, you've been playing the fiddle for over, what, 10 years now since yep. you're a young kid and, and now you're at Lakefield College and going to school out there, things are going good? Yeah, yeah, things are going great. The newest thing that's happened uh, with music so far is uh, launching my merch just today. Um, and there's Irish Millie merch and Fiddling for Fox merch, uh, partnered with Imprinted Apparel right. and uh, Barking Pixel Design, and uh, we got some uh, great merch out, so. Okay, what I love about this story is your dad plays with you most of the time, right? Yes. Murray, yes. you don't call him dad, you call him Murray. Yes. You know, when, you, when you're playing gigs. And maybe a lot of people don't even know that it's your dad, but he has got a following of his own now. He sure and, does. And there's a possibility there may be some, some Murray merch, yeah? It's yeah. possible, okay. yeah. I was working on the design today for some uh, Murray merch. I call it the Murray clan. Right. Uh, and uh, after I finish playing, usually they yell, Go Murray! Yeah, everyone loves the Murdoch. Uh, is he still teaching? Yeah, he's still, yeah, he's still teaching grade five over at Strath. That's Strath? Okay, yeah. all right. He's still going strong. And um, I tell you what, you're doing great. and and, and your dad's been a big part of it, but uh, you're, you're 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 the star of the show. I mean, you're you're gonna kind of move on with with or without a sort of thing, right? Your career is just kind of going to another level. What's next for you? Well, uh, this summer I am going to BC on a on a big tour for July, uh, and then uh, flying and shooting over to the uh, opposite end of the country, the East Coast, for another festival. Yep. So uh, I'm super excited because I've been to BC uh, just last year for the Canadian Folk Music Awards, and it's just beautiful. And uh, mm -hmm. so I've gotten into many festivals, um, and I'm super excited to play. And, and you and you get as excited to play the festivals as you do say the Black Horse or any sort of the local, I mean, you just love to play. Yeah, I just love playing. Honestly, there's like this magic in the music that just makes me want to keep doing it. And uh, having my dad there with me is just uh, super magical too, because, uh, yeah. yeah. And, and not just your dad, you wrote a song recently about your, your brother. I did, That's yes. Neat. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so it's going to be coming out soon. Um, yeah. And he's heard it and uh, he has told me he listens to it every day. So oh, nice. it made me so happy. It was very heartwarming, but yeah. I'm super excited for, uh, for uh, the city to hear it in the world. Is that where, are you going to start doing that a bit more? Are you going to start singing a bit more on, on, on your music? Yeah, so I actually wrote another song that I'm going to take into the studio here uh, with my producer, Tyler Martin, and uh, it's called So Gone. I've played it quite a bit uh, around Peterborough, um, and I think I'm going to release it in the spring because okay. uh, it's really great. Yeah. Uh, St. Patrick's Day. One of the busiest days of the year. For you. <laughs> One of the busiest. I mean, Irish Millie is in demand on St. Patrick's Day, but it's coming up down the road, and you're going to be playing a few different gigs, I assume. Yeah, so I'm going to be playing uh, up in Newcastle at the Snug from 10:30 to 12:30. Uh, I'm playing a few private events, and then hopefully I'm going to play at the venue that night because there's a big St. Patty's Day bash going on down there. There is. Yeah. And uh, I would love to get in on that action because uh, I got some Irish music that needs to be heard. Yes, you do. Okay, so we'll we'll make that happen for sure. Sure. So the big parade will go down George Street. Yeah, everyone's going to be flowing into different oh, pubs yeah. and establishments, the venue being one of them. So we hope to see you there. Uh, before we let you go, what advice do you have for young musicians out there that, uh, you know, kind of are just getting started? Uh, I think that sharing your gifts is the most powerful thing you can do. If you've got a talent, you don't always have to have a whole bunch of money to make the world a better place. But I think just sharing that talent with other people, spreading the joy and not giving up because it gets difficult a lot of the time and uh, you just got to push through it. I love it. I love your positivity. I love your attitude, uh, your music, obviously, too. And thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me, Pete. Thank you for watching Hometown PTBL, brought to you by The Pile Group, CIBC, Wood Gundy.